Comic-Con for two days. There's plenty of food in the fridge. Not anymore. And Liz will come check on you tomorrow. You'll see. I'll be back before you even know it. Oh, for the love of lasagna, Odie. You gotta learn to look at the plus side of things. John is gone, which means we can do things like this. <laughs> Adopt a smart cat And choose him very fast He'll be like your child Your life will be wild I am a smart cat I am a smart cat I'm a smart cat. I'm a smart cat. Be on this point, have no regrets. Garfield is no ordinary pet. With your smart cat, nothing will be flat. This is a smart cat. Thank you. Hey, Odie, want to split the last slice? <laughs> oh. And now, I'm going to watch bad TV all day and do absolutely nothing. Big change from yesterday when I watched bad TV all day and did absolutely nothing. There's only one thing I don't like when John is gone. This is him whether he's going to be gone for 10 minutes or for 10 months. If only I could make Odie believe that John is still here with us. Hmm. Of course. Why didn't I think of this before? Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> A pair of dirty socks. Perfect. Now, he just needs a face. I happen to be real good at drawing, John. Eat your heart out, Jim Davis. Behold, voila, John too. <laughs> Odie, guess who's back? <laughs> Aren't you happy to see John? And now for the final touch. <laughs> Hello, this is John Arbuckle. I am not in right now, but if you leave... Well, what do you mean that he's not in the bathtub right now? Hello, this is John Arbuckle. I am not in right now, but if you leave... <laughs> John, is it all right if I eat your meal too? If you don't say anything, I'll assume it's okay with you. Good night, John. 
What's that, Odie? You want John to throw the stick for you? What's that, John? Garfield? Will you throw the stick for me? Sure, John, I'll throw the stick. <laughs> Wonderful throw, Garfield. Oh, thank you, John. Boy, that wind's starting to kick up. Garfield! Odie! <laughs> Uh. Garfield! Odie! <laughs> oh, you heard me. No, but I smelled the pizza. I came over to bring you this and to make uh. sure John's windows were all closed. It's windy out there. <laughs> I saved a slice for you. I mean, uh, half a slice. Odie! Huh? Oh no! Odie! Odie, come back! Odie! Odie! Like a red one for my darling little son, please. Here you go, ma'am. I don't want a red balloon. I want the one with the head and the stupid looking face on it. I want that one. I'll pay whatever I have to for it. Here. And it's all yours. <laughs> Yay! It's mine. All mine. <laughs> So we gotta make these, Leon. It's a balloon that looks like half a person with a really stupid face. Excuse me, I need another balloon. What does it look like? You know that guy with a cat? The cat that eats lasagna? I need another one of those balloons. And now she wants to buy another one. I'm telling you, Leon, we'll make a fortune. <laughs> I need to find Oni before that dumb doc gets into trouble. I want my balloon back! <sighs> Guess I'm a little late. Hey, hey watch out! Hey! Out of my way! I want my balloon! Let go of that child's balloon, dog. <laughs> one of you has one because I sure don't. Wait. <laughs> Sorry, buddy, but this is an emergency. Bodie, wait! 
This making another John is not looking like one of my better ideas. They're heading towards downtown. What do you mean they've run away? I don't know what to tell you. One minute they were here, the next minute they were gone. I've looked for them everywhere. Uh, I'm on my way back from the airport. I'll be there as soon as I can. <laughs> Garfield? Driver, follow that cat and dog. <laughs> I've got way over my contractual limit of running scenes in this episode. Someone call my agent. Buddy! Come on, Odie. I just talked to the construction workers, John. They're still trying to find the right tool to get you out of that concrete in one piece. Hey, look at it this way, Pooch. At least he won't be leaving home again for a while. 